Live your life within the moment, moment And don't go wait until the morning, morning You never know when it is over, over All that I know is we'll get older, older So let us dance this side away Morning! We're in our Hard Rock Hotel room. Woo! We got graded to a garden, not a garden, from a garden view. We got graded from a garden view to a pool view. view. You got the pool on the there? right here, it's better to set better from this side, I think, than each other. It's an early morning. We had the best guy at check in. He was lovely. Checked yeah. us in really, really quickly. Andre, I think his got name was. Got our express passes. Yes. Matt I've... got the best card in the whole place, he said. Got the best one. Got Harry Potter. Where have I put it? Here it is. Harry Potter. It's the best. Just show you the room. It's a very nice room. It is absolutely mahoosive. It's been an early start this morning. It is currently five past eight and we're already in our room. <laughs> hey, look, they, they had the room ready. He upgraded it and said, look. Well, our ready, actual so room wasn't ready, so he upgraded us. So. He said, you know what? No extra charge. You can have He it. was like tra really trying, wasn't he? He was like, um, go on, Andre, you can find it. You can find it. You can find it. He celebrated, didn't he? He's proper celebrated he, for us. He was us. trying to find the upgrade room Yeah, already. he's trying to find to see if there was a free upgrade for us. So he was what lovely. What a legend. What a legend. So I... I have a mixture of feelings right now. Matt's feeling scared. <laughs> I'm, a little bit, I'm a little bit apprehensive. I had a, my stomach was nearly better. And now I'm not sure it is better because... But he thinks it's just nerves. Oh, it's, oh yeah, 100% nerves. I'm a bit scared about these big coasters. I think I prefer Big Thunder Mountain at Disney. Should do your outfit of the day. All right, yeah, nothing snazz today. We've got the linen shorts. Abercrombie's, got Soul Cow, old school. Old school. Old school. And your normal trainers. The trainers which haven't worn for a few days to be fair. So, you know, all good. And what have we got for you today then, Tom? For my wrist, I've got normal trainers. Yeah. I've got these shorts. Those Hollisters, they're like a two-tone. I think they're Hollister, they're Hollister? Hollister. Hollister, they're, they're ASOS. They're ASOS. These were last minute purchase. Last they came minute on purchase. these ASOS. So you got a light side and a dark side. Yeah. Which is, you know, like your good and bad sides. My good and bad sides. Mm. Um, my uh, angel and evil. That's and it. then yeah. this top is Hollister as well. Mm. And I got all my hair plaited. Very, very nice. And the and plaits are doing all right today. I reckon the plaits are some of the best of the whole day. Are they? And thank you, mother, for that. So we will catch you when we're probably walking across. And last but not least, be nice. Be nice to us. Excited. I'm a bit scared. But so here's Rip Ride. Yeah, it's the end of Rip Ride. So we're going over to. So what's the situation? We're doing we're not using our early entry, are we? No, we're not using early entry because we basically missed it. We've only got 10 minutes left. So we're actually going to go to Universal first, thinking this is going to be the quieter of the two parks. Yeah. And then we'll park hop later. And then we're here tomorrow as well, anyway, aren't we? So we can use early entry tomorrow. Yeah, yeah. We've got the express passes and we're ready to go. Ready Unlimited to go ones we got as well. Haven't Unlimited. We? We're in Universal! Alright, oh, let's hit some coasters! Where are your parents at? I assume back there somewhere. They can start. Right, we the, chose the right key. What's the plan then, Tara? So I think we're going to try and do ri Ride Rocket first if it's open. Have you seen that? Have you seen the bloody. It goes vertical upwards on the way up, like proper vertical. Exciting! Scary! Alright, I'll get my first out of the way, then I'll calm down, then I'll be super excited for everything else. Oh, what else is on this side? Bringots, Mummy, Men in Black. Mommy. Yeah. Alright, Tara, we've had a bit of a bumper half hour or so, haven't we? Yeah. 
All right, we are currently at Fast and Furious, but we'll fill you in in a second. Look at that. We got the old, got the neon to the lot. Look at that old school American motor. We got the bangers on. All right, what have we been up to, Tara? Hollywood Red Rocket, yeah. and we did Race Free New York. Today. Yes. Just gonna scan the cars quick. Thank you. Um, Hollywood Rip Ride Rocket is such a good roller coaster. We were the first on the ride. But front row, first car of the day. Front row, first car of the day. It was so good. It was ridiculous. But yeah, because we had the express passes and this isn't the early entry today. So it's way quieter over here. We're pretty much walking onto every single ride. Um, Thank you. All right, and uh, I guess we'll, uh, we're not allowed to film on rides in Universal, but um, we'll catch up with you shortly. Yeah, where's my invite? Hey everybody, I'm Mia, Dom's sister. Oh, okay. Well, another race just wrapped, and it looks like my brother with another car for his collection. Shocker. Honestly, I don't know why anybody challenges oh, him. Oh, no one does. Okay. Well, we're meeting up at Sullivan's Garage for the after party, and while Tej works on your rides, you guys enjoy the break room. My brother calls this the family room. Dom says he doesn't have friends, he has family. He calls me his friends. And the pieces you see on these walls are family. My photo's not even here. in this room, I feel like we're all together again. Like a family. So, welcome to our family. Wow, that was so powerful. I'm quaking. All right, all right, what's up, Mia? And Pat, Tej, too. just welcoming these good people to our family. How are their rides coming along? The rides are ready to roll out and roll out in style. All right, I'll let Dom know. You guys have fun at the party. Have Bye, fun Mia. without me. All right, Pat. Yeah. Let's get these people on their way. Send them over to the war room. Is that where my invite is? Peace. <laughs> <laughs> All right then, Fast and Furious. It's, it's a bit of fun, isn't it? It's like some little, it's a little simulated thing. I tell you what, I wouldn't want to wait. I wouldn't want to wait like too long for that. But it was a good bit of fun. It was over. I thought it was over quite prematurely. It was fine. It's a simulator, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Which I didn't know, to be fair. Um, so we're going back to catch up with Tara's rent now, and I think we're hitting up the mummy, which I've been told is an indoor roller coaster. I don't know. Maybe we'll do that. We're doing one yeah, drive. I guess so. Okay, well maybe not then. Yeah, yeah. yeah. We'll catch we'll up with you in a bit. is going to be TikTok sensation, Jordan! Thank you over there. Yep, they're very polite. Or is it going to be something on the street from nobody knows where? Brandon! Woo! You got a woo. You got a woo. The deciding factor was the woo with Brandon! We want it for him. Thank you very much. You're not bad yourself. That was all you all I've no water to. All right. Tara's mum has convinced us. It's gone ET. It's gone ET, my god. Anyway, look, put some boots over there. We just we saw a bar. Show. Yeah, we watched the blues show. That was really good. My big whoop at the end. Got the guy the win. I think I got that on camera as well. Decent. Um, those, those impromptu shows are really good fun, aren't they? Yeah, it was really good. That was the scene, wasn't it? Oh. That was great. Are you sure ET's open? Send ET this way. It's still saying ET. It's just a different route. Okay. Uh, 
Hard in our dust. Hard in our dust. At least they're kind about it. In Epcot, they just wreck the park. Here we go. All right, we'll tell you how bad it is in a minute. All right then, E.T. Tara. Uh -huh, I'm just not impressed by E.T. ever. So no? I've done it every year. Your mum loved it. Back to the future park. Oh yeah. DeLorean. It's the time machine. Ooh. Fun, sir. It's pretty cool, isn't it? So E.T. is not too impressive. I'm quite impressive, but you said it wasn't as outdated as you thought, didn't you? Yeah, to be fair, I'm surprised it doesn't feel like you're in the 90s and completely. I think but, it does. Uh, well. Each there. And as you can see here, we have just entered Springfield. Oh, the thing is, I'm not sure I can stomach it right now. Those big donuts, I've heard they got absolutely ginormous donuts in them. What have they got? Big pink giant donut. 10.99, it's not bad. Oh, so got Moe's. Oh, do I go for a duff? That's a good question. One thing I forgot about, Tara. Yeah. Duff beers. Duff beers. In there. We might have a quick look. Pretty cool here. Yeah, we're Moe's. Yeah, this has got a pool table that you can't use. Oh, and they've got a few different beers over here. What have we got? Let's have a look. We've got all your, all your beers there. Flaming Mo, I wonder what the Flaming Mo is. Oh, interesting. I've seen it in the UK in Lidl's before. What, Flaming Mo? No. Duff beers. Yeah, but I never picked any up. That would have been quite cool. They've got some kind of quick serve over here. Interesting. It is looking old school, to be fair. Right then, not sure we've caught up in a few rides. We hit up Simpsons, which is a really fun simulator actually. Old school, but uh, that was super fun. Um, Men in Black just now. Yeah. Me and Tara lost by about 100,000 points to your mum, yeah. didn't we? So she is sadly the Men in Black champion. But what we've got here, by the looks of it, is Harry Potter. We are in London. This all feels very familiar. Does it? Very familiar. A bit of Leicester Square, decent. King's Cross as well. Been here plenty of times, plenty of times. Where'd you get your butter beers from? Is this this side or the other side? Both sides. I might have to try one. Oh, I had the, had the old thing there. Look at that night bus though. I want to ride on the night bus. That was pretty cool in the movies, wasn't it? We re-watched all the movies just before we came out, didn't we? That is so weird. I've been from King's Cross. I went on the Eurostar. Oh, it's a Disneyland. But we are in Universal. Okay, we're hitting up Leicester Square Underground by the looks of it. I'll tell you what, the weather's a lot nicer here than the real Leicester Square, isn't it? Jesus Christ. Look at this. Wow. All your Quidditch supplies there. Weasley's Wizard Wheezes. Is that their shop with all their um, the cool stuff in? Look at that. There's that dragon. And I can see Gringotts. My God, it's busy here, isn't it? Leaky cauldron, fish and chips, cottage pie. Wow. It's a very British menu in that leaky cauldron. I think is everyone waiting for the, uh, oh. They're all pointing their wands. Ice cream. Are you going to pop in any of the shops today, Tara? No. Damn. Oh. Everyone's got their cameras out. It must be doing something. Oh. That is hot. 
it wasn't already 30 degrees outside Tara, it is now. Oh, a bit Diagon Alley, wow. This is super cool. Alright, come off Gringotts. That was super, super fun. We'll get Tara's thoughts in a minute. Just hopping in. So they're in uh, Florian Fortescue's ice cream parlor. I'm going to meet him again in a sec. Just going to pop into the magical menagerie. Ooh. Everything animal related in here, it seems. Get some Florian Gringotts. <laughs> Those are, I mean, I should. Oh, mandrakes, that's it. They're the mandrakes, green mandrakes. I've just been playing Harry Potter. I put 55 hours into that game. I haven't played it for a. Well, finished it within like a week or so, so. Uh, struggling to remember. Oh, we've got a few hours on the go. An owl mug, oof. It's a bit scary, that. What's even scarier is probably the price or something. Like. Oh, you know it's not bad. It is not bad at all. Very cool little place. Anything animal related? Head yourselves into it. Yeah. We got a few hippogriffs. A couple hippogriffs in there. A few chamber of secret stops in there. It's actually pretty good. Wait, Dollars, do you know what? Not bad at all. That is something that I might pick up actually. Uh, in retrospect. Let's find out. No, I'll meet these guys at the ice cream place. And uh, see what they picked up. We've just had some food. Oh, wait, Mel's diner. Mel's driving diner, the one with the cars outside. We just shared some chicken, didn't we? Obviously we had chicken tenders, yeah. Yeah, Ten but we 10. shared it. Yeah, we Plenty. Did. And we're just eating King's Cross. King's yeah, Cross. Either Across to the other park. This all looks very familiar. Very familiar. I'll tell you what, it's certainly hotter in this version. There's a nice bit of aircon in here. Though, There's some fair. nice aircon in here. Yeah. We're near the arm. Go on. Go on. Right, you must you might have just seen my fantastic effort running through the wall. Tara's not convinced by the looks of it. Uh, we are at the Hogwarts Express. Look at this. Beautiful. Beautiful. It's just like the GWR trains behind me. Go on my house back home. And of course you've got all the tourists taking their pickies. Oh, of course they are. Anyway, still a bit of a queue to go. Tara's getting the pics for the ground. Donna's not getting the pics for the ground. I think we're gonna hop on the train. I've been told we're not allowed to film on the train. So you gotta come here. You gotta come here yourself to experience it. And we'll catch you on the other side. Right then, where are we, Tara? Hogsmeade. Hogsmeade, I tell you what. There we go, exit to Hogsmeade. I've been spending a lot of time here as of late. I've been cruising around. I've bought loads of potions from JJ Pippins. I'm hoping that's here. On your gate. Oh yeah, well yeah. Oh, my finger was in the way there. Well, yeah, Hogwarts Legacy. What a decent game that was. 10 out of 10. It does look a bit sunny here, but there's a bit of snow, so it's a bit confusing, but... <laughs> right, let's see how well they've done it. Here we go. Oh, look at this. There's Hogwarts in the background as well. Oh, here we are. There's a nice chilled area here where everyone's munching on the lunch. There's Dogweed and Death Cat. Spent a bit of time there, spent a lot of my uh, my gold coins there, I must say. What else we got? Also, you can hear Hagrid's in the background, so that's yeah. really good. We saw it just whizzed past, didn't we? We're going to do we're... Forbidden Journey first though, aren't we? Yeah, yeah. We're going to hear Hagrid's later. Pick your owl post, decent. What's that coaster there, Tara? Like the oh yeah, it's like it's a more tame one, isn't it? Yeah. The magic neep as well. Oh, it's 
popping off. Hogwarts, this away. What was that? Wow, look at that. Woo! Tell you what, it's a good day in Hogwarts, in Hogsmeade. Oh, is that where you get your, uh, that must be a mobile, uh, mobile Ollivanders over there, yeah. Tell you what, one thing about this place, it is busy. We've just been inside Hogwarts. I'll tell you what, I, wasn't, I, I didn't know what to expect from that ride, but it was very, very, very cool. They've just done every Harry Potter ride so, so well. Um, it's like a gyro, partly a simulator kind of ride, soaring style, um, and partly like proper inside stuff, flipping you around, it was so, so good. Lots Here of coasters she is. back up, so. The lots of coasters back up, we're on the way now. We've just seen it. People are whizzing past. I've heard it's smooth as hell, but you lose gravity. And that's my kind of coaster. Fantastic. Right, I'll let you know what it's like again. Yeah, sadly, actually. Universal, you can't show anything at all. But next few times we go to Disney rides, we will start filming a little bit more. Uh, we've done obviously all the ones we wanted to do first time Mostly, and take yeah. in. This is my first time, so I just want to take them in. Uh, so few more Disney videos in the next week or so. We'll see a lot more. Right then. When, when was the last time? Yeah, when was the last time we caught up? I think it might have been pre-Velocity. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, sorry. Sorry about that. So Velocicoaster. And it was amazing, wasn't it? Velocicoaster was absolutely ridiculous. That was, I wish we got our reactions when we first came off it. Because the thing is, you're not allowed, everything's in lockers and stuff, so. And we had it with Tara's mum for some of it as well, so we didn't have the camera with us to uh, to do our review. It but, was really uh, good though, wasn't it? Oh, the twists and turns, the loops. I always thought like the pads that they have on these roller coasters were slowing you down, like the brakes. That one sped you up. They were all to speed you up today, like quite a lot of them. Um, the Lost Coaster was 10 out of 10, I reckon, would you reckon? Yeah, Lost Coaster was 10 out of 10. Then we did Hagrid's. Yeah, we managed to get on that. It was a 70 minute wait at the time that we got on it. Which was insane. There is the surprise in that that no one tells you about. Yeah, there's a surprise <laughs> and we're not we're not going to spoil it. We're not being we hope you spoil come it out here no and one had try told it us. We didn't know that was a thing. And that took us way by surprise, the surprise in that one. I was just like, Ooh. We definitely want to do that one again. Absolutely. Um, and then we've walked on down and we've done Hulk as well. Hulk was like a walk on. It was like a 10 minute yeah. wait or something. Really quick. Straight on the front of that. That. That was great. Maybe it's because of how dehydrated I am at this point in the day. Even though I've been whamming drink the whole time. We've been, we've uh, paid to have our Volcano Bay Cups rethinked, haven't we? Yes. So we've been free refills all day. Yeah. So because we bought, I've just had a look over there and touching on that, it's $15.99 for the cups um, each if you're buying two, which we bought did. two. So that's $17.99 for buying one. Wow, okay, so there is a saving. I yeah. didn't, when we bought the two, I wasn't sure if there actually was a saving. And if you buy three to six, it's $13.99. So you save another few dollars again, depending on how big your group is. They're just trying to make you share it less, aren't, aren't they? I mean, that's the idea. Yeah. But we so refilled them for, you have to pay on the day when you come back, it was 10.99 plus tax uh, for each of them. But so we have, not but bad. it's like nearly $5 for one bottle of drink here. Yeah, it's $5 every time, so like, like the tax is $5. we have way over used two bottles of drink, is what that would have been between us. Yeah. We've been using this, this has been great. We've been Didn't... switching between Fanta and Powerade. Yeah, it's been good, it's been good having the fizz and then just having some really hydrating drinks in between because it has been hot today, about 30 degrees, pure sun, hardly any breeze. But, I mean, we've got through about, what, we've filled it up seven, seven, six, seven times? Yeah, so yeah it's it worth it. And it's a shame because Tara's told me before that's how Disney used to do it. Yeah, years ago. This is so good for the hotels, this is so good for the water parks, but not a thing for theme um, parks anymore. Yeah, yeah. So a bit of a shame that, but um, I'll tell you what, Hulk was a headbanger, but it might have been because I was dehydrated, I don't know. Um, I did pre-warn you as well. 
is the rougher roller coaster of them all. Well, to be fair, it's pretty smooth though. I didn't think it was rough necessarily. It is just like the ups and downs, the loop de loops, like they just get the blood's going all over the place in your head. Um, it's the only one with proper loop de loops. Yeah. But that was super fun. And we could have gone on it again, but my head needed a rest. And so we need actually, to fill ourselves up really quick. We've actually got a reservation at half seven tonight. So oh. we've got a reservation lighting. at half seven tonight at Hard Rocks. We don't want too much. We're just trying to get a pizza slice between us. Mm. Albeit, I'm not sure how. I reckon we ordered like 10 minutes ago. Still no food inside. It didn't take 10 minutes to cook a pizza, is what I'm saying. Very nice, right. Big pizza slice. Boom. Woo. That's going to fill us up before the hard rock it, tonight. But looking forward to hard rock tonight, you're going to go for a chicken burger probably. You love the chicken so. there, don't you? I love the chicken there. And I'm going to go for the double double cheeseburger, whatever it is. It's so, so nice. Because I'm feeling a little bit better today. It might be the paracetamol, might be the roller coasters, might be the adrenaline. But we'll find out later. Um, so yeah, we're going to hit this. How much was the, how much, what's the, what's the going rate, Tara? $11. $11? $11? Mm. A quarter of a medium pizza? It's quite expensive, it was $31 for the whole pizza. Wow. Well, but it does look super cheesy. Looks good. We're going to tuck into that and we'll probably catch up with you back at the Hard Rock Hotel. We're going to go home after this. We'll go back to the hotel after this, aren't we? Yeah. Go and get in the pool, it's a really hot day. Really no cloud, no breeze. Jump in the pool really quick uh, and then we'll get ready for the night out and we'll take you to the Hard Rock with us. Yeah. A bit breezy. Two and four is a very nice temperature. We've just gone for a dip, but now we're trying to warm up in the fridge. I'm warm again now. Yeah, I'm, I'm getting there. I'm not, I haven't warmed My up as much like as you. Dry, much again. Yeah, yeah. But it's a really nice, cool setting over here in the in the hard rock. Oh yeah, the DJ. It said he finished at four, but he's, he's still going over there. So that's the beach club over there, main swimming pool here. They've actually got a beach over there. And they've got loads of cabanas and stuff. They try and, I mean, they've got TVs in a lot of those gazebos over there, haven't they? Seems a tad excessive though, but. So we're making the most of our stay tonight. I guess so. Look, look, there's obviously a market. They're everywhere, aren't they? Every single water park and stuff like that we've gone to. And these are full cheaper. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They've even got a water slide over there. Very cool. That's the beach club, straight down the middle. Stop going down it, haven't we? Yeah, some little kid came off it. It didn't. It didn't look very fast, to be honest. It looked like an adult's one, but I think it's just a kid's one, to be honest. That's okay. So yeah, we haven't picked up a drink or anything because we're only down at the pool very briefly. Yeah, we've got about 20 minutes or so to leave the Yeah. Now, hour to get ready. Have a shower. Get the shirt ironed and then we're off to oh my towel seems to be flying in this video there we go so you can tell there's a breeze yeah, it's oh it's nice though that sun i mean you can see that sun look at that look at the weather today honestly it's been ridiculous well i mean how would you describe the feeling when you're leaving the parks after all the heat it's so hot i was just exhausted i could barely stand on my two feet so i'm just appreciating We've got the ferry down. Down. Yeah, got a bit of footage of that. You've seen that. The water taxis, each of the... Is it only for deluxe hotels? And one of the other low hotels as well had them. Because it was five. Was it Maybe two. Was it five? It five. Or four. Maybe four spaces for both there, but only three deluxe hotels. So yeah. I think maybe one hotel also has it that isn't a deluxe. Yeah. So, all the, as Tara said, yeah, the three deluxe hotels plus one other, we think. You can all get a water taxi. To be fair, from the Hard Rock, don't we, you don't need it because we walked it this morning in about five minutes, didn't we? Yeah. 
but it was yeah, nice to get. To it must have left just before. Yeah. Oh, it was nice. Very nice. And worked out whether anybody's got any like refillable drinks here yet, like resort mugs. I don't think anyone does. Okay. Yeah, but it's not. It's a paper cup, though. I think. Oh, it's not. Uh, so I think you can get Res Universal Resorts mugs as well, but they're probably about 20, 20 odd dollars. So we don't need it because we're off in the morning. Yeah. We'll do the same thing with the Universal Cups for the resorts that we did today, though. Hundred percent. We got through so much stuff. Yeah. Um, but anyway, yeah, as you can see, we're just chilling, vibing with the tunes, and we'll uh, we'll catch up with you when we're on route to the Hard Rock, I think. So, we've had our hard rock. We missed filming that bit. We were just so hungry and so caught up in it. We forgot to film the food again. Day night. Oh, no. to film the food. It's very good though, isn't it? Really, really good. So we we go we try and go to a hard rock everywhere we go. But that one there had loads of options on drinks and on food. Yeah, so, so we both had slightly others. different things. Yeah. Um, what did you go for? A grilled, I had a chicken, grilled burger. chicken burger. So that one's the Chasseur. Straight through. The Hard Rock Coliseum. It's the largest hard rock in the world. Yeah, that's what she was telling us. Yeah. That's what she was telling us. We had a really good time there. Oh, I'll tell you what, we could add this to the vlog and I'll tell you what, I might get some There's a couple absolutely screaming at each other. <laughs> they passed. They, yeah, they've had a nice day at Universal, right? She's just run away from him then. Okay. She keeps saying leave me alone. She keeps. So she said. We're she, people watchers, by the way. Said, yeah, we are people. I mean, we love it. Yeah. <laughs> we are such people watchers. But I, but I mean, my God, it's not hard to see sprinting after her. My God. Right, so she said, if you want to be friends with her so bad, just go and be, be with her. So I'm not sure that he's necessarily cheated. We don't know. <laughs> We're playing guess game. It over. doesn't sound like it, but he has a friend that's a girl. She's extremely uncomfortable. Anyway, none of our business. None of our business. We're anyway. just walking down City Walk. Yeah, yeah. It's a lovely atmosphere. The parks have just closed, so everyone's piling out. Yeah. We're just going for a walk, but yeah, the Hard Rock was a large one. We try and go everywhere. It was really good food, wasn't it? But do you want to tell them the bad news? Oh. So we collect <laughs> Hard Rock bears. Everywhere we go. Everywhere we go. And they've sold out of Orlando bears. <laughs> We're going to name him Orlando and everything. <laughs> They might get a delivery on Friday. And we're still here then, so later on in this vlog series, you might see us back here just to buy a bear. We're going to check the hotel later though. There's a yeah, slim there's chance that the hotel still got some. Some, but... But they're so popular. That, Damn it. Yeah. Damn we started it. a trend there. Yeah, yeah. We've uh, collected them ever since our first holiday to Edinburgh together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How many bears have we got now? Wow. We've got... Three, this one is going to be the four card rock. Yeah, yeah. New Edinburgh, York, New York, and Mallorca. Yeah. It's going to be the four card rock, but we have bears from everywhere that we've been. We've bought bears from a spa, we've bought bears from centre parks. The whole caboodle. There's a whole window sills worth back at home. Yeah, of named bears. But it's cute, it's cute. But anyway, we're just having a walk round. What's going on Taking here? the atmosphere. Give it a spin. Of course, there's food clubs. Yeah, I'm sure. Night clubs. Kind of. I don't think quite. Red is coconut tree. club. Yeah. It's a nice Dark ice cream tea. shop. Cocktails. Cold Stone Island. Creamery is supposed to be a very nice ice cream shop through there. Yeah. Red oven pizza bakery. Yeah. Some place there is always quite popular. What's it called? Cowfish. Cowfish for burgers and sushi, but. We're not really into sushi and... Um, I still need to can get burgers anyway. A cinnamon? They do that in the UK now. You can order it by like... Oh, I'm sorry, the bloody service station down the road from me. Yeah. Oh, the Asda, you can all pre-order them and stuff like that. I don't know if they're any good. I do like cinnamon though. But 
we might film we might film when we're back at the hotel we'll just have a walk around yeah we we'll go to the bit hello we're back in the room i just thought i'd give you a quick room tour we have been we have unpacked a little bit and got dressed in here and used it a bit so excuse our mess but um you come in the door this is a wild map there was a wardrobe here which had like the ironing board and the ironing but we've used that for our clothes this evening and then you've got a big mirror here like this just got our swimming stuff because we went into the pool earlier and just some toiletries on it at the moment and then in here you've got like the toilet and a little mini bath with a shower over it it's a big bathroom area and then we've got two beds because we paid for four people in this room in order to get four express oh. passes so um, i'm taking this bed and tara's taking the other bed <laughs> So, um, my parents, in theory, have a bed in here, but obviously aren't staying in here. Um, it was just that they also had the express passes with us today. So, we're going to sleep in this bed, and this bed's just currently got all our stuff in it. And we've got a big TV, the staple hard rock mirror where it tells you how tall you are compared to everybody else. And then, as you might have seen earlier in our vlogs, a huge window here where we got upgraded. And it looks out onto the pool area, which I think they're just getting out and cleaning the last little bits off out there now. Because it's shut at 10 o'clock and it's now 8 minutes past 10. And we've got a little breakfast bar area and a chair. And that's it. It's a very nice room, isn't it, Bob? Yeah, very nice. I've never seen like a breakfast bar in a... You've got charges in the breakfast. And then, it's a Starbucks or something. We've also found out, we went down to the shop, we found out that if you have the Universal mugs that we have that we showed you earlier, at the Hard Rock it's $2.50 mm -hmm. to refill them here. So you're going to go down in a minute, aren't you? And yeah. just refill it with a drink for the night. Because um, the shop here is um, open till midnight. That's what they said, yeah. Midnight. So we're going to go and get Pretty a good. refill. And then I think we're pretty much going to have an early night now, aren't we? Because we've been awake since 6am well, yeah. to get here this morning, so it's been a long day. It's been a great day, but a long day. Yeah, it's been an absolutely great day. One more day in Universal tomorrow. So we've got another day of those express passes. Yeah. We're going to be doing a lot of repeats and then also doing the stuff that we hadn't done. Most notably the water rides. So we We're haven't done the water rides. Splooshed. So hopefully they're the last three things, last there's three water rides, so they're going to be the last three rides we do tomorrow before we get in the car, I think. Um, there's a couple of shows we haven't done, we want to see Born Stuntacular that we didn't see yes, today and things like that. that'd be really, really good. And then we're also going to do a few repeats and stuff as well, go back on Hagrid's, go back on Velocicoaster, etc. All great coasters, by the way, like, it is, it's a nice change to, to Disney for a couple of days. Um, but obviously, you know, it's marketed differently it's it's for a slightly different crowd i guess um and between the two you have a great balance of all the coasters because yeah. you get the complexities of coasters over at disney like guardians which you just do not you know these are like just thoroughbred coasters here but guardians are just so so clever and stuff like that so it's been really fun for me because i haven't done any big coasters since well i haven't done a proper coaster since Incredicoaster. Well, was called now called Incredicoaster was California Screaming in in Disney California, but that has a a single upside down loop and stuff, so it's a proper outdoor coaster and stuff, and I've absolutely loved it. There's been a couple of rough coasters. That Mummy was a little bit rough. Yeah. That but one was is. but was pretty cool. I mean, it gets you pretty hot. I must say. The um, fire room. But I did highlight of the day. Yeah, highlight of the day. Do you know what? I'm actually going to say. Being the first ones on Rip Ride Rocket in the morning. That being was super cool. Front row. Front row. On the first on the first one with people in this morning. Yeah. Was pretty cool, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah. As it's Matt said, we were well. the crash dummies. I said we were the crash test dummies. Like they, they just run it around with no people and said, yeah, get them on, and then we put in. But it, it was, was a, great. Fun. It was a great way to start the day. Great experience. Uh, Absolutely loved it. There's the yawn. There's we the yawn. Um, so we're probably going to end it here, aren't we? Yeah. Get some sleep and we will see you for 
a second day at university. Yeah, tomorrow. another day at university tomorrow.